The second half of Region 74A play tipped off Tuesday with a battle for first place in the girls' side between the Bluffton Bobcats and the Hilton Head Seahawks. After a back and forth first quarter, the Bobcats surged ahead thanks to Koya Hayward and breakout junior sensation Jelania Mosley. Both put up 13 points apiece in the game to help lead the Bobcats to an impressive 51 26 victory over the rivals across the bridge and vault into first place at 5 1. But the boys then took the court looking for a bounce back effort after Friday's road loss to May River. Both teams came flying out of the gates of the frenzied start, with Bluffton's Jalen Linder knocking out a jumper at the buzzer to tie the game at 19 after one. It was a spark that repelled the Bobcats to take control in the second, but a clutch three from Reese Stewart capped off a 10 point quarter for the Seahawks sophomore and put it led within three at the break. Linder kept up his dominance in the second half including a strong drive the hoop for an and one. It was Deion Grant who took over down the stretch for Bluffton, scoring a pair of huge buckets in the paint to maintain the Bobcats' narrow lead. Hilton Head's Ja'Cory Walters made a three-point game with under 30 seconds to play, but Reese Stewart couldn't knock down a game-tying triple as the Bobcats held on for a massive 60-57 region win and a remarkable 30-point effort from Jalen Linder. The Bobcats moved to 2-4 in region play and are tied in fourth place with the Mariner Sharks. For LocoSports.com, I'm Wes Kirk.